This is the free motion quilting tutorial for star flower bands. This video is a part of the free motion quilting project created by Leah Day. So far over 300 designs have been published to the project for free with video tutorials just like this one. Check out the other designs and share them with your friends at freemotionproject.com. Now let's get back to star flower bands. This design is stitched by first starting on the edge of your quilting space and stitching down with a wiggly line and then you're going to stitch a set of overlapping straight lines to create this star shape. Just a small little star and then you're going to wiggle your way back out just echoing that line. Travel stitch and you're just going to build up that wiggly line, that wiggly set of lines so that way it creates kind of a little band. And now you're going to work your way around that star shape just bouncing in and echoing around with kind of a flamey leaf shape. This is a star flower. Once you fill around it once, stitch back to the edge of your quilting space and continue stitching down to create the next band. This is working from edge to center, so I'm just simply stitching down into the center of the quilting space or close to it. Sometimes I like to vary how far I kind of stitch into the space just to kind of play with it. And uh, then we're going to work on the opposite side, matching up with this side so that way they connect. Now I'm simply working in another star flower right here. And star flower is another design, so definitely check that out on the project. There is star flower and star flower flow, two designs that are variations. Uh, if you like this kind of shape and you like the, how the design is looking, those would be great designs to try on your quilt along with this one. Okay. To get to the next side, all you're going to do is simply travel stitch, or if you were working on a real quilt, you would probably break thread. And then you're going to wiggle up, and we're just going to connect this wiggly line with that star flower. Wiggle your way back, travel stitch, and wiggle in, connect it again. This creates a really beautiful banded texture that's going to look great on the surface of your quilt. Try placing this in the sashing or the borders of your next quilt and see how beautiful star flower bands can be. And here's what it looks like whenever you finish it. Are you interested in learning more about free motion quilting? Make sure to check out the Free Motion Quilting Project and find over 300 video tutorials just like this one. Check it out at freemotionproject.com.